Have you ever wondered about the birth of a new ocean? A spectacle so grand, it redefines the map of the world as we know it. Today, we dive into the fascinating phenomenon occurring in Africa where, believe it or not, a new ocean is forming. The African continent, with its diverse landscapes and unique wildlife, is now the stage for one of the most intriguing geological phenomena to occur in millions of years. This vast land is literally splitting apart, paving the way for the birth of a new ocean. This geological drama unfolds in the East African Rift, a tectonic boundary extending for thousands of miles from the Gulf of Aden in the north to Zimbabwe in the south. The rift is a result of the African Plate, one of the many tectonic plates that make up the Earth's surface, splitting into the Somali and Nubian plates. But how does a rift turn into an ocean? Well, it's a tale of molten rock and immense geological forces. As the tectonic plates drift apart, they create gaps. These gaps then fill with molten rock or magma, which rises from deep within the Earth. Over time, as more and more magma fills these gaps and hardens, a process known as rifting, it forms a new crust. This process is identical to what happens at the bottom of our existing oceans. And for this reason, scientists believe that the East African Rift is an early stage of a new ocean basin formation. This phenomenon is not a quick one, though. It takes millions of years for an ocean to form. The Atlantic Ocean, for example, was born out of a similar process over 130 million years ago. As for the new African Ocean, it's still in its infancy. But every day, bit by bit, the rift grows wider and deeper. The birth of this new ocean is a stark reminder of the dynamic nature of our planet. It's a testament to the fact that the Earth is an ever-evolving entity, reshaping and reforming itself over millions of years. So to recap, the birth of a new ocean in Africa is a result of the East African Rift, where the African Plate is splitting into the Somali and Nubian Plates. As these plates drift apart, they create gaps that fill with magma, forming new crust. This process, known as rifting, is identical to the formation of existing ocean basins, leading scientists to believe that a new ocean is being born. So, the next time you look at a map of the world, remember that it's not a static image. It's a snapshot of a moment in the Earth's geological history, a history that's still being written. As the rift in Africa widens, the map of the world slowly but surely continues to change. And with it, our understanding of this fascinating planet we call home, continues to evolve. We hope you've enjoyed our video looking at the reasons behind the formation of a new ocean in Africa. Please like, share and subscribe for more fascinating content like this, and join us again in our next video.